uh, a strong relationship uh, in the industry and also in government because the, the changes that are happening, if you just look at it uh, internally, you might not be able to make a sound decision uh, because you don't have all of the information that you need. So I, I think that uh, these CEOs will learn from the experiences and thoughts and insights of uh, other CEOs in the industry and also you know, uh, executives in government. And, and therefore, I think uh, in this day and age in the Philippines, that is important. Um, you know, from we have baby boomers, we have Gen X, we have millennials, and now we've actually launched our, our brand, a new brand, and to be more youthful. That's why we're we're very excited to be presenting the Young Lead, uh, Young Leader of the Year Award, um, you know, by Living Better. So very much focusing on the youth. It's uh, we always say that you know it's not about the generation, but it's how we engage employees. Uh, and, and develop people. So we always focus on the customer, we focus on people. When we say we focus on people, that's people, capabilities, and culture. Part of that is enabling them. I think that the nature of work, the values and expectations of millennials are actually quite different from uh, the previous generations and they will be different from the generation that's in school right now. And that's kind of scary because we just got adopted to millennial in terms of how the Gen Z's are completely different. But millennials, first and foremost, are engaging and are looking for jobs, even here in the Philippines, uh, where they can learn first. And they care about what they can learn, uh, even as much as they care about compensation. So I'm not saying it's more important than compensation, it's equally important. Congratulations.